Now, looking at this, let's let's cover some foundational things here, okay? So let's talk about game, right? You teach a kid to age game. When you teach a kid game from ages, look, I'll use this sloppiness. Oh, look at me. I'm an artist. Uh, game, okay? Yeah, I officially hate this fucking writing pad because I can't rest my hand on it. So what the fuck is the thing for? How do even artists dry on this piece of shit? Fucking artists, what a bunch of losers. Just joking. <laughs> not all of them. <laughs> Definitely not our man Timothy. So with game, right, you just realize one thing and one thing only. You got to teach the kid from a young age, okay? Love is not real, okay? Love is not real, okay? Tell the kid from day one, listen here, Billy. Love isn't real, okay? Soulmate. What the fuck is my pen doing? Soul. Mate. Equal. BS, okay? The one is you, motherfucker. I found, I'm looking for the one. I'm just looking for the one, the one woman that I will have sex with for the rest of my life and never grow tired of it. Yes, my chakras are now aligned. Okay. Okay. Teach a kid from the get-go. Love is not real. Soulmate equals bullshit. And the one is you. Okay? If you guys don't donate $100 right now, don't know. you're a beta male, me money? you're a cuck, you're a blue pill for life, <laughs> you better send me $1,000 a donation right now. <laughs> and, and that's uh, Asan Haji Mohammed with the two euros... Says, what to prioritize in your 20s? Game, muscles, or money? Keep watching. You'll figure it out. Uh, let's see. Uh, Dipin Madhavji with the two euros says, Sydney is a liar. He mute everyone on live stream. I don't give a fuck. He's a loser. I found out who he was. Game, set, match. Checkmate. Over, bitch. Suck it. If you guys don't donate a hundred dollars right know. now, you're a beta male, you're a cuck, we go. you're a blue pill for life. <laughs> Thank you. You better send me a thousand dollars of donation right now. <laughs> and, and that's so rich, it's unbelievable. Uh so the one equals you, and then so here's here's this thing here, okay? This is pathetic. Okay. This is extremely pathetic. Stop. Looking for meaning in love slash women. Stop it. It's fucking embarrassing. Okay? Absolutely embarrassing. So these are foundational things you should have in your mind for game. Number one, love is not real. Okay, now let, let me just let me let me just clarify this. Okay, now, yeah, duh, love is real. It's chemicals that our body pumps into our blood that says, "Hey, keep fucking her with no condom, come inside her, make babies." That's love. If you feel like I love my girlfriend and I want to protect her if the building crashes or breaks down or whatever, right? Great. You know why your body's telling you? It says, hey, protect that asset. Come inside her. Make some babies and have her raise them. It's good DNA in that. If a lot of people gave them chance, you know, within themselves to allow themselves, you'll find out you love many women. I tell all my bitches I love them. Yeah, baby, I love you. Love you. Love you so much. Yeah, absolutely. Do I love more some more than others? For sure. 
Do I hate some of my bitches? Absolutely. So fucking once a month, I hate each of them. Because you fucking lose their mind, man. You gotta like, you know, pimping ain't easy, bros. Pimping ain't easy. Um, you know, that's that. Stop looking for meaning in emotions and love and shit. It's it's gonna lead you down a bad path. Okay? Not good at all. James Dormandy says, love chemically no different than large amounts of chocolate. I don't know. I've wanted to fuck a girl before, but I've never been like, oh, rock, I got to eat some chocolate. I've got to lick that chocolate's vagina. No, I don't. It's not the same. Okay, there's levels to this. But I just appreciate the, appreciate the, uh, the, uh, the uh, statements there. Okay, let's go back. To All right. 14 to 18, okay? And, and for all you all you red pill tough guys, all right? All you fucking tough guys, here's here's one word you've really got to eliminate from your vocabulary because quite frankly, it's pathetic. Okay? Eliminate this fucking thing right here. Seriously. Okay. She's special. She comes from a good conservative family. Where did I meet her? Oh. When did you fuck her? Oh. Did you use a condom? Oh. Oh. Okay. She's special. Gee. Thank you so much. I was wondering... If she was like all the other whores on that website, but she is special. Thank you for clearing that up. What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. At no point in your rambling, incoherent response were you even close to anything that could be considered a rational thought. Everyone in this room is now dumber for having listened to it. I award you no points, and may God have mercy on your soul. Okay. May God have mercy on your soul. Okay, because if this is your plan right here, all right, I here, okay, here's a spoiler alert. If this is your plan, okay, spoiler alert, you are, can you read the secret code? You got to put on the 3D glasses. Can you read the secret code? Oh, boy, oh, boy, I can't say the word because I'm in YouTube timeout, but you tell me, you tell me, can you read what I just wrote? Because that's you, okay? Okay. 